I'm, I got him with a messed up lure. I can't believe that. <clears throat> Good morning, folks. Welcome to another video. We are at Okaloosa Island Fishing Pier this morning. I haven't been here all year, but I've heard some good reports. So we're gonna go out there and see what it's like today. And you know what? I like making these pier videos because a lot of you guys are coming down on vacation right now. You're like, Brent, where do I fish? What do I do? A lot of y'all like to fish the piers. So hopefully you'll get some value out of this video. We're gonna have a crew out here today. Bearded Brad's coming out, my dad's coming out. So it's gonna be a lot of fun and the reports have been pretty good. I know they've been catching some fish. Now we do have our pier cart loaded down right here. I've got my custom made pier rod, my pen slammer 5500, and I've got a white X-Wrap tied on. Now that X-Wrap is pretty much a catch anything lure out here. So if you like looking for one lure that I would never leave home without coming to the pier this time of year, that's it right there. You can catch Kings, Jacks, Bonita, Spanish, you name it. It is crowded this morning. I can tell you this, it's 6.30 a.m. and there's already a full parking lot. Brand, you're good, dude. Thank you. Excuse me. Now, if you do come out here to fish, it costs $8 per person to fish. And if you just want to walk and check it out, it's only $2 <clears throat> to walk and check it out. But I want you all to look at this. What a beautiful morning out here. No wind, it's pretty much glass. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh my goodness, look at that. That's wild. We're going to walk out to the end here, folks, and just see. There's a lot of fish blowing up on top out here. So, Oh, there we go. Well, that didn't take long. First cast. <laughs> It's never good to hang one on your first cast, though. No, no. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> that is that my spot right there, too. <laughs> <laughs> I walked away to pee. I'm telling you. Come here. Get up. Oh, get your head up. That gummit. I don't know if I can sling him or not. You know, I may break my line. I think I can get him up. Dang, they're big. <laughs> Check it out, y'all. First cast off the end of the pier. Nice bonita. Well, those are some of the hardest fighting fish out here pound for pound. Those are super aggressive. Great bait. Not the greatest fish to eat, but that was fun. All right, y'all. Let's walk back out here. There's still fish blowing up. Good gracious, they're blowing up out here. My goodness. Yeah, I know. I thought you said you were going to come out here yesterday. You know, I was, but I slept in yesterday. <laughs> no kings? One this morning. Oh, my God. I can't believe it.
Yeah, whoop. Yeah, they're thick out there. You can keep as many as you want. No. Mm -mm. You want it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Another nice Bonita right here, y'all. God, these things fight, and they're thick out there. Here you go, man, right here. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's your name? It's uh, Angler Up with Brent. Yeah. Nice, nice. Yup, I do YouTube full time. So. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Yup. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Have fun. Yeah, thank you. What are those? Bonita. Bonita. False Albacore. There's a couple names for them. All right, folks. Let's go back out here. While they're still biting, there may be a king, maybe some Spanish. Who knows? I've seen some big Spanish getting caught, and I know they've been catching some kings. So. We'll see what happens. This white X wrap is is the money X wrap. If I if I had to choose a color, it'd be white. You gonna do it to me again? Man, I don't know. I'm, I, I'm two for three casts, so we'll see. Class is in session. That's right. <laughs> making us out, making us look silly. Come on. Oh, there we go. Nice. Right. Dang it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, I got him with a messed up lure. I can't believe that. <clears throat> okay, I'll take it. These are these are fat ones today. Ah, they fight. Why is this dang fighting so hard? Almost acting foul hook. He's fighting so weird. Yep, I think he is. Yep, he sure is. That's why he's fighting so hard. He's hooked in the top. <laughs> That, that's why he fighting. I did that on purpose. Ugh. I ain't never gonna get him up. Maybe. Get it? I think I can get him up. I got him. If it falls off, he falls off. Heads up. There we go. <laughs> What's that? You want it? You want it? Come here. Taking a little break right now. The bite's kind of slowed down and it's hot. So those bonitas are fun. Now I'm waiting on something we can take home and eat or maybe some tarpon. There's been a lot of tarpon come through. I wouldn't mind hooking up on one of those. All right, folks, we tied on a swim bait just because they're seeing a bunch of tarpon come through. And so if a tarpon comes through, this NLBN swim bait right here is what you're going to want for them. So.
And there's so much bait down there, okay? That whole black wad that you're seeing down there is bait. And so every time this bait scatters is when those tarpon come in. And that's when you throw. So you throw when you see the bait scatter. What's up, bearded Brad? What's up? You seen anything? Yeah. Cruising that line right there. It's the first time I've fished with you all year. I know. <laughs> this is my first time on a pier all year. Look, there's one right there. Golly, look at it. That's a big one right there. I don't want. I don't want him. I want something smaller. <laughs> that, that one was way too big for me. <clears throat> I want a 40 pounder. This is a bubble rig. Okay, see it's halfway filled with water right there. That allows you to cast a light lure like this little glass minnow jig. And these glass minnow jig work great for stuff like Spanish mackerel and bluefish and stuff like that. However, we uh, you got to have this bubble in order to cast it off the pier because of the high elevation right here. The locals call it a touristy rig, but it is extremely effective and nobody can argue that. There are more fish caught on a bubble rig on these piers than any other rig uh, out here. So. There he is, got him. Ah. That's a blue there. We'll see you, buddy. All right, that was a bluefish. We're gonna try, try to go up from there. That was a little baby. Let's see if we can get us a big Spanish or Bonita. Something like that. Ooh, that was a good one there. Dang, lost him. Golly. There we go. There's another one. Stay on. That's a decent one. There we go. All right, nice fish. Let's go and see if we can get on another one. One keeper so far. Let's see if we can get number two right here. All right. They were getting after it pretty hardcore there for a second. Oh, he's chasing it. He's chasing it. Oh my goodness. I thought I was going to be on right there. Oh man, he chased it up good that time. There we go. There's a nice one. Yeah. That's a decent Spanish. This one felt a lot bigger than he was. <laughs> he saw that one from a mile away. No doubt. Come here, buddy. Another Spanish right here. They are firing off. Nice fish. Oh, there they are, right there. There's a bunch of them there. Oh, he's on it. He's on it. Come on. There we go. Oh, that's a nice one there. <clears throat> there we go. That's a good one. Come on, buddy. Come on. Heads up, guys. I'm swinging him over. Don't want to slap you in the head with a fish. <laughs> Decent fish right here, y'all. Check it out. Nice Spanish mackerel. And let's go see if we can get another one. I'm gonna grab my rod and get back after him. <sighs> oh, he's on it, he's on it. Come on, there we go. Oh, dang, that was another good one. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh, no wonder it's making weird. Catch any carpet this year? Man, I've only tried a couple times and I have been unsuccessful. I mean, if they come in, I'm, I'm ready for them, but I have. I bent out the hook a couple days ago on one. Really? Oh, there's a good fish. Oh, dang. Hey, that was a good eat right there. Coming over. Yeah, you know, we are wearing out the Spanish mackerel right now on Okaloosa Island Pier. It's kind of a blitz out there. Good morning. All right, y'all, let's keep it going out here. I came out here to catch tarpon, but I will catch Spanish if that's what's biting. You can't, can't turn away the Spaniards. I know. I, I mean, I'd rather hang a tarpon, and I may. I may give it a shot later, but. I know. I, I, I got here at 6.25, so. I know, and I woke up at 4.30, and I was like, I'm going to sleep in until 5. All I had to do is get up at 4.30. It's hard, man. I know. <laughs> I know, man. Especially when you don't when you don't have to. I'm like, ah, I'm just gonna sleep in a little bit. Yeah. I can't complain. Oh, there we go. I break out a bubble like once a year, but I gotta say they work. <laughs> Yeah. You have to admit they're fun, too. I do. I mean, I think they're, they are fun, Dad. So do you edit them if somebody else does? Um, I do it. I just feel like it uh, gives kind of like a personal touch so yeah, you to your creativity. Cool. See, I think, I think that's great, too. It doesn't have to be super crazy. Perfect. Nah, mm -hmm. no, you know, I feel like that the goal is to make someone feel like they're, you know, out here with me on the pier or on the beach or wherever I'm sitting. It does. Yeah. Look just like a bobo. Oh, there's a good one, dude. That's a good one. There you go. There's a fish. Oh, there we go. This one's not a big one, but I'll take him. <laughs> yeah. Ah. All right, another blitz coming through right here. Another Spanish right here. They are firing off. Nice fish. Check out all those cobias right there swimming around the pylons. Those are all cobias. They're juvenile, undersized. I want to give you guys a better look at these fish swimming around the pylons. So I did attach a GoPro to my fishing rod and I'm going to drop it down. Check out those little cobia. And Okaloosa Island is located on the Florida Gulf Coast, just west of Destin, Florida. So if you are traveling to Destin, Florida, get on over to Okaloosa Island Pier and check out some of these fish. And there's some snapper right against the pylons right there. Some remora, some amberjacks or barjacks. All right, I'm going to try to catch one more and then I'm going tarpon fishing. The dolphin run them off? I think so. Yeah. Missed again. Swing and a miss. That's yeah, not a swing and a miss, though. I don't see the dolphin, so I'm going to take it easy. This might be foul hooked. There we go. Yeah, he is foul hooked. That's why he was fighting so hard. Oh. Woo! 
Folks, if you enjoy the peer videos, go ahead and shoot me a big thumbs up right now. I would greatly appreciate it. And if you have not subscribed to the channel yet, it's free to do so. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I try to post two to three videos a week on this channel from the state of Florida. Other than that, folks, we'll catch you next time.